The world's largest cowboy boot sculpture is 35 feet, 3 inches tall. It measures 30 feet long, 9 feet wide, and weighs 10,000 pounds. Bob Wade was a pioneer of cowboy funk art in Texas. In 1979, at the age of 36, he had just become famous for placing a gigantic Lone Star iguana on a New York City rooftop. Washington, D.C.'s tastemakers yearned for Texas-style architecture, so Bob was invited to construct something comparable on an empty lot in the capital of the United States. Bob surveyed the property before creating a work of art to occupy the space. A pair of 35-foot-tall, artificial ostrich and calfskin cowboy boots. He worked for six weeks and was paid $7,000 for his work. Bob finished the boots, which he had made mostly from scrap materials, on September 12, 1979. The boots had only been in Washington, D.C. for four months and then they were subsequently purchased and shipped to Texas by the San Antonio North Star Mall. Because the boots were so enormous, the trucks that carried them had to take back roads to make sure that they got there safely. Both boots arrived in the mall in relatively good condition, and Bob reinstalled them there January 16, 1980. During the first several years of the San Antonio Rodeo, a DJ broadcast live from the top of the boots. Tailgate parties would be held... During a particularly rowdy year, someone got excited and kicked a hole in one of the heels, letting a homeless person then find a way to occupy that space for a little bit of time. Mall visitors noticed rising smoke coming from a sterno can that the person was using as a burner to help heat and feed themselves. This ultimately led to the capture and banishment of the homeless person that was occupying the space in the boots. In 2016, the Guinness Book of World Records acknowledged the pair as the largest cowboy boot sculptures in the entire world. While not everything may be bigger in Texas, Bob Wade can continue to rest in peace knowing that his boots are the largest around. He passed away at the age of 76 years old in December of 2019 in Austin, Texas. These are interesting things with JC.